Hi there and welcome to today's video and I've got a super quick, super simple question here from Nihil and Nihil's wanting to know my favorite type of speed work and why. Well Nihil, as far as speed work is concerned, it is abundantly simple. Do I have an absolute, absolute favorite type of speed work? I suppose depending on the type of event that I'm, I'm training for, yes there, are, there is one specific workout that is I love doing the workout because it just leaves me absolutely shattered at the end of it but then I need to be in exactly the right type of frame of mind but more, more about that but as far as speed work sessions are concerned do I do that, that favorite so-called favorite of mine week after week absolutely not the important thing about speed work is you have to mix up your type of speed work sessions 300 meter repeats 400 meter repeats 800 meter repeats kilometer repeats, mile repeats, all of these type of speed work sessions are, it, to my mind, equally important in your development as a long distance or potentially ultra distance type of runner. The, the reason why I'm saying all of these speed work sessions are equally important is for one very simple reason, is that if you just do 400 meter repeats, you become really good at running 400 meter bursts. If you do just one mile repeats, you become really good at running just one mile bursts. But if you're only doing one mile repeats and become good at one mile bursts, and you're needing to kick for the last 400 meters right at the end of the race, you won't have that built into your repertoire. So each and every single different type of speed work session needs its place in your training program because by just doing the one type of speed work session you training your body to be able to handle just one type of form of speed in a race, race day situation so mix and match your different types of speed work session that way you're giving your body different types of, of stresses and which requires different types of adaptation to be able to cope with these new types of stresses so that's my take on the matter and getting back to my, my favorite, I've actually got two. The one is the 800 meter repeat session and the other one is what's called the Oregon 3040 speedwork session. I'll post a link to the Oregon 3040 in the comment section down below the video so you can have a look at that. It's absolutely brutal but at the, while at the same time being absolutely brutal it's a very much a training session that has a although open in the time frame of how long the training session lasts there's a very specific time where, where the if you miss your targets by 10 percent that's it the speed work session is over but it's uh, Oregon 3040 is best done with a buddy with a coach that can maintain the stopwatch for you but that's my take on the matter post any comments, questions, criticisms that you may have, post those in the comment section down below the video. Don't forget, share this out amongst your running friends, thumbs up if you like this content, thumbs down if not, that way I know how to make these videos better for you in the future. And last but by no means least, there's a big red subscribe button down below this video. Hit that subscribe button, that way you stay subscribed to my channel for all the new content that comes out on a day-to-day, week-to-week basis. Stay carved up for the win out there. I'll see you next time. Cheers.